welcome back to my channel we just got to the airbnb we're extremely exhausted alley traffic is not a joke like it's fucking crazy i have to unpack and we're gonna be here for four days i had no idea what to bring so i just brought like everything because you know like sometimes i'll bring something and then i won't like it and then i'll be so mad at myself and then i feel ugly for like the rest of the day yeah like we don't want that so i just like brought all my favorite stuff all my friends are here with their boyfriend and i'm here by myself it's okay it's okay it's okay wait i have a whole room to my self Yeah. Hey guys, we're in LA now. Finally, after that nine hours. You can see the clickbait. That run clickbait. <laughs> Ooh, I almost fell. Do it for the views. Nope. Take your shirt off. <laughs> I'm here with Cece. Anyway. Uh, that's another reason we have to discuss the... Uh, okay. <laughs> hey, can you guess where I am? I'm in Rosemead right now. We are here for Camp Vlogna. Bro, who would have thought I would have ever came here? Today is Saturday. Today is the very first day of Vlogna. If you don't know what Vlogna is, it's a music festival that is created by Tyler, the creator, the one and only. It's a two-day festival. It's gonna be really hot today, so like, but tomorrow my outfit's gonna be hella cute. I just came up with this look today, but we're gonna like put on the wristbands. This is how they look. <gasps> oh my God, there's an ant. Ew. On my pillow it's disgusting anyway i am like super excited because i have been waiting for this day since may i think i see juice world and i'm see tyler the creator and all of them i've never been here before so i don't know what is gonna like pop off i just hope i don't like forget to vlog because when i'm like out and stuff i forget to record things and you can't really blame me so don't be mad let's go see what everyone is doing come on jared look what i have <laughs> and we're already parked and everything so we're just like walking to the like entrance what's up y'all it's been a nat cc welcome to the nat vlog period i bet you would fuck with me now i'm gonna change my mind if you ever switch it up Can I get a kiss? 
coming out tonight. This year eight, I built this from the ground up with a great team. I'm back at the house. I'm literally so tired. But I still have to like shower and stuff. Today was like 91 degrees, but when it was like nighttime, I was fucking freezing cold. By the time I got here, I was like so hungry. Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed because I'm tired as fuck, as you can see. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay. Good night. make some food so come on so welcome back to my channel it's day two of the festival we're finishing up getting ready and stuff and then we're gonna head out but check out the fit i'm gonna show you guys so i just have like this shiny head scarf and then i have the purple wig chain then i have like this bralette i got it from target yesterday when i was watching juice world it was literally so crazy in there and i was getting smushed as fuck by everybody rest in peace to my shoes they were not like this we just made it to the campsite we're ready to fucking party bro to say we're gonna have fun as fuck. Basically, what I want to say is that we're all bad bitches and we're here to have a good time. Don't drink underage, guys. <laughs> a, a. <laughs> I have so many snacks in my pocket because the food's hell expensive and I was hella hungry yesterday, so I have like. I like your hair. Oh, she looked ready, you, bro. Blood orange. performing and we have no idea who it is and it's driving me crazy can we just party and have a good time for the next hour yeah. i still fucking hate you though nigga fuck you You guys, I'm lost. So I'm walking back to the car because it got too crazy in there and I don't know where the car is. Fuck! 
um, quick little update. Savannah called me and she's coming to the parking lot. I think I see it, I think I see it. Ooh. <laughs> so I'm in the van because we forgot to lock the door. <laughs> At least I don't have to be in the cold, right? Right? It was weird because Drake performed, right? He kept saying basically he was gonna do another show. He like left the stage in a hurry and then there was still 20 minutes left of the performance time since it was the very last show. Everyone was like there. What the fuck? He didn't come up and no one else came up like. See like all those cars over there are exiting and so are those and the ones over there and the ones over there and no one has like even moved at all but man i'm fucking hungry fuck they have me starving in there and shit everything costs hell expensive you know how much the funnel cake was the funnel cake was 15 dollars like it doesn't even cost that much at the state fair we still bought it though i got some merch so i got a golf tee and i got some golf socks just some more basic white socks dinner everyone's hella tired hey guys i'm back at home we just got back from la yesterday and then i have like school today and stuff sadly i was getting a lot of dms regarding drake getting booed off stage and i just wanted to like explain what happened because everyone just thinks that we just like booed him off because we didn't like him but that's not that's not it so to start off, the very last performance overall was a secret headliner and no one knew who it was. Rumors had it that it was going to be Frank Ocean and everyone was like really excited about that because it's Frank Ocean. Lil Uzi Vert and ASAP Rocky. Tyga performed too. And lastly, it was Drake and everyone was just going crazy. I, I even like, I don't really listen to Drake like that. I just listen to like, you know, his popular songs on the radio and stuff. But I was really excited to see Drake because I never seen him live. So like it's it's fucking drake like i was happy hella people were hyped like a lot of people were hyped he started like singing like two three songs and then it started getting boring no one was getting like hyped anymore everyone thought the secret headliner was gonna be frank ocean so i think people were like disappointed kind of frank ocean has like different music from drake or camp vlog now that music is different you know like there's still rappers there but it's mostly like I don't know how to explain it, but Drake is like really mainstream. He's really, you know, he's like, everyone knows Drake. I'm assuming there was like more artists after him. He said something like, I know I'm not supposed to be on here for that long. I'm only supposed to perform a few songs or whatever, but I'm gonna stay longer because you guys are having a good time or something like that. He kept saying, the thing that was just irritating me was like, y'all want me to keep going? And at first we were like, yeah, like, Keep going, fuck yeah. It just started to die down and then he was like, you want me to keep going? Cause I'll keep going. And everyone was like, mm. like I even said, I was just like, bro, like who's gonna come after, after him? Cause I was just getting tired. That resulted in getting booed off stage by the people in the front. I was all the way in the back, all the way in the back. So we were so confused because he wrapped it up really fast and we were just like, okay, who's gonna come up next? Like, is it gonna be Frank Ocean? I didn't even know that he got booed off until I went on Twitter. That people like in the front, I seen videos that were like, boo, boo, boo. I don't know if he actually signed a 10 year contract though. That probably wasn't a good idea. It was really weird because it just ended so weirdly. Like I was expecting Tyler to come out again and just be like, thank you guys for all for coming. We were literally just standing there waiting for what's gonna, like what was gonna happen next. It was literally just so awkward. We were like, what do we do? And then we started seeing people leaving and we were just sitting there like just waiting, you know, like seeing what happened. My friends and I just like left and I don't know what happened after that. I don't know if someone like, came out or something, but Other than that, I had a really good time. It was such an awesome festival. I've never been to Camp Vlognaut. I really do want to go again. I was not expecting to see like Lil Uzi Vert or Sherlyn Mafia. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. It was really fun seeing everything that I recorded and I wish I recorded more, but I was just so into the moment that I even forgot to record and like vlog because I was having just a really good time. So I have to go to school now. So, um, I had to 
take an exam. I'm gonna go now. I have to go to school. Bye. I whoop your ass. Your girlfriend look like my mom. Well, I have a good day. And all my homies wanna ride today. That's right. And all these mommies look